Welcome to another episode of Unturned. Today I joined a full Vanilla Washington server. We're going to do a lot of PvP and some base raids. I hope you guys will enjoy this video. If you do, make sure to drop a like, subscribe, and let's get straight into the action. Fresh Vanilla server. I haven't played here at all. I do have myself an Eagle Fire already though, so that's pretty good. Now the server is called Washington VMC. Now today I just want to run around. I want to do some PvP and maybe some base raids. But I've also thought of doing a little challenge. By this challenge, I mean I will not build a base. I will literally not have a base and every single progress that I have will be on me. If I die, I will lose everything. So I'm going to lose Scorpion 7 really quickly. I'm trying to get as much XP as possible. We really need to max out the first page at least and i'm not going to be solo nicole is going to play with me for a bit Loaded Scorpion 7 got myself a Shadow Stalker and the Viper with a couple of rails. Nicole actually told me that there are people in military and that they seem pretty geared. So if we do manage to kill them, that would be huge. I'm going to give Nicole the Eagle Fire and I'll just stick with the Shadow Stalker. That's for you. Now I have no idea where they are and you can't really see anything with this rain as well. But I'm going to push so that maybe we could actually see better. Alright, he's dead. I saw his night vision, man. If he turned it off, I would have seen him. I'm gonna push for this guy's load. He seemed pretty geared. So maybe we'll get an upgrade from Shadow Stalker. I think there's more people at the towers, though. I don't know where. I don't know what's happening. Oh, I think Nicole killed him then. Oh, Heartbreaker. Uh, some ammo of Peacemaker. Wait, is this all he had? Oh, wait, there's another guy there. Oh, he's dead. Okay, so this was the trio. Oh, man, I have to do this jump. Let me salvage this knife. And here we go. At least back. Oh, okay. A charge. Eagle fire. Blowtorch. Very, very good loot. Let's check out what this other guy over here had. Okay, this guy was even more geared. A drum, night vision. He has a Zubek, heartbreaker, saber tooth. And these guys were geared. I actually didn't expect this. I already have a full inventory. I should probably take the saber tooth instead of the shadow stalker, actually. More ammo. Well, there's some people on the other tower. I'm not sure if it's the same people. Put the shadow stalker scope on saber. I could see his arm. I hit him once. Headshot. Oh, there's a guy down there. All right, he's dead. All right, I'm gonna push, actually. Well, they combat locked. They actually vanished. They actually combat locked, man. Now I am going to run around the map, loot, get XP, and search for base raids. For that day, I did leave. There was a lot of people that left the server as soon as we started killing them. But then on the next day, I joined and the server was pretty much half full. All right, well, I'm just gonna run around. I did find some base raids yesterday, but I kind of want to find a live raid at the same time. I'm gonna loot as much as possible. Hopefully, we'll get ourselves a detonator because I still don't have raiding gear except for a grizzly. Well, would you look at this? Looks like we found ourselves a live base. I'm not gonna kill him yet. I should probably push. Seems like he didn't actually finish the base yet. Let me scrap that viper and make myself a couple of plates. So that whenever I'm there, I could easily build. Now he probably knows that I'm here if he can hear me. Alright, let's place two plates over here. Oh, he's over there. Oh, he, he must know what it... Oh, he's so confused, I think. Alright, he's dead. Oh, wait, that bed's not even claimed. Alright, let's see what loot he has. Wait, does he have a bed then? He might not even have a bed. So back. Yeah, he doesn't have anything good. Dressings. Schofield. Another Schofield. There's another base here. Maybe this one actually has his main bed or the main load. Oh, there's beds here. Unclaimed as well. Snor- Oh, he's back. I heard him. All right, let me salvage this plate actually so we could go back inside. All right, well, we know- He had the Cobra. We know where his bed is now. Salvage his vest so I can make another plate. Yo, wait. He has a rocket launcher. What? I didn't see that. Yo, let me take that. Let's get the hell out of here then. I didn't even realize he has a rocket launcher. Wait, I could try to run line raid him right now. I could try to destroy his bed. Maybe he has better loot in there. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's take the heartbreaker out. Oh, hi. Yeah. Well, uh, there is some stuff in here, but nothing that good. There is actually another base over here. And I did manage to craft myself a couple of rockets from all the raw that I've had. So hopefully it will be enough. What is that? Is that a locker? Can I maybe make this jump? Oh no, that's not a locker, right? Yeah, that's a oven. Can I maybe make a plate? Oh, let's salvage the knife, make ourselves a plate so we could actually enter. Do it right over there. And hopefully this rocket was worth it. Claimed bed. Oh, chainsaw. A bunch of junk. I'll take the chainsaw actually. Cross scope, some scrap. Nothing that good from over here. Let me destroy the bed. Oh, crates. Okay. Oh, grizzly. At least back. We already have one. Yo, Horde Beacon Detonator! It's been so long since we've actually seen a Horde Beacon on any server. Well, a bunch of more junk. Two Elise packs. 
Night Vision, Night Karev. All right, well, we did profit from this. It's another crate over here, right? Yeah. Dragon tried to seal this off. They tried to hide it. Didn't really work out. Dragon Fang. I didn't expect this from one rocket. We got all of this loot. It's a really good vanilla raid, actually. All right, so we could actually go to the Horde Beacon at military. And maybe we'll get ourselves Dragon Fang boxes since this Dragon Fang is empty. So that sounds like a really good plan. Hard beacon, here we go. I do have myself the chainsaw to kill the zombies, and then I have a bunch of ammo enough to kill the mega zombie. It's actually been a real long time since I did the hard beacon on Washington. And the hard beacon is pretty much done. Hopefully we'll get ourselves some good load. Wasn't that hard at all, actually. Wow, this sucks. Actually, you know what? Echo and the high cal box is okay. That horde is so bad. <laughs> I guess we got a PTW. I kind of like that. Good secondary if I run into underwater PvP. There's a guy up there. Wow, he almost killed me, actually. Seemed like he was a green skin as well. All right, let's go check out what loot he had. I think there's like a villain duo on the server, and I think he's one of them. There's some loot over here. Heartbreaker. I could take the bed and put it over here. Just in case I get killed, I could come back easily. All right, let's check out what loot he had. Oh, there's some... There's a dress... Oh, Spec Ops vest, actually. I could switch that. It's much better than the melee vest. Damn, he was geared. Yeah, raw explosive. Fully decked out heartbreaker. Fully decked out saber tooth. Full thief as well. There's a guy in the farm. And he is dead. Go check out what loot he had. Well, he didn't really have anything. I don't even have The problem with this challenge is that once I've got a lot of different raiding methods on my inventory, it's kind of hard to take new stuff. So we're gonna always have to leave a bunch of loot flying around. There's a guy over there. All right, and he is dead. Let's check out what loot he has. Oh, there's another guy over there. All right, he's dead as well. This guy damaged me quite a ton, actually. Seems like he has some okay gear as well. Uh, Viper, Monster Key. Yeah, I have no space, man. Let's fill up some magazine. All right, first kill loot. He has Eagle Fire, a bunch of meds, a bunch of mags, a bunch of food as well. And vanilla food is kind of important as well, because if I don't have food, I die. I heard some shots have... Oh, yeah, there he go. Cobra, dude. I don't know if he's shooting at, there might be a mega zombie, or he's just shooting at zombies. Oh, there is a mega zombie, actually. Yeah, Alright, let's kill him and take the mega, because I want the XP. Alright, he's dead. Mega zombie dead as well. He was about to kill him, actually. Alright, let's go down. And high kill. Grenade. Two grenades, actually. Take the high kill box. There are these wardrobes here, and there's literally nothing to raid on the server. And I do have myself two charges, so I'm gonna break them. Because pretty much the whole server is raided. And... Uh, Mad kits, ammo, blowtorch. There's people in here. Oh, he's so low. There's like two guys in there. I'm gonna flank them from the roof. Oh, there he is. I'm pretty sure there's more people though. I don't know where he is though. Alright, let's go check out what loot this guy had. He had the Shadow Stalker, Eagle Fire. I gotta kill these other, this other person though. Wait, there's his toes. Hello. What the? Okay, well, a lot of food. Aces, saber tooth, viper. Nothing that good of loot. I saw his toes from outside. There's a car. Alright, one dead. Let's blow up the car. I hit him. And he is dead. I was running away. He had a Zubag though as well. This guy had absolutely nothing. Okay. Oh, this guy was pretty geared. Eagle Fire, Zubag, Ace, Cobra, a lot of ammo. Why did he give the, one of the guns to those other pairs? This guy had like three guns on him and the other guy had nothing. That's why you gotta always share, bro. And he is dead. Let's go. He has an Elise back. That's pretty much it though. Some food. I'll take the food. Right now food is kind of more important than anything. Alright everybody, that's going to be it for this video. I really hope that you enjoyed. If you guys want more videos like the, the same challenge or maybe a different challenge, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!